like to use my hands here and do like my little foot off, like my little chop, like Fruit Ninja. If you remember the game. Um, and so, kind of the same setup. So, um, for me, um, right when I started off, you know, I felt more athletic, I felt faster here you know, in triple flexion. Now I'm getting more comfortable with it here. I'm a little higher up. So, um, I will, depending on the level, um, uh, add in a little bit more uh, flexion with the table. So, if I'm thinking a little bit lower, then I'll bring this up. Um, if I'm thinking a little um, like C3, C4, then I'll bring it down just a little bit. So, um, you can do like your little lateral glides to assess. And so, for me, like that actually feels worse. <laughs> and so, I'll do my little dance, if you will, and then make my way. So, that feels like tighter right there. And then I'll go all the way down. And just kind of assess. It feels, uh, like up here, this side sucks, and then it's not as bad on this side down lower, but down here, like that doesn't feel great. I would, I would guess. But then I usually just like confirm. I was like, "Hey, Pilar, that did feel <laughs> great um, to me. Did it feel okay to you?" Yeah, these two. Yeah, so I'd say like these areas, um, you know, uh, could potentially be targets that I'd go after, and so. Um, I, I tend to bias a little bit more towards the upper if we've got a combination of the two, so to speak. Um, but uh, like, say this was fine, and then all you're finding is like irritation there. So we'll call this like C4, C5. Um, what I'm going to do is just add a little bit more flexion than I otherwise would with C1, C2, and then I'm going to do same technique. I'm going to start off with a little bit of rotation, but instead of bringing this one off the occiput on the C1, I'm going to come right at that level that she had that pain. So for this one, I'm going to be like right at C4. Um, and what I'll do, so imagine your spinous process, your transverse process, I'm going to put the um, lateral border of my first um, uh, DIP here, and, and I'm going to kind of come by the spinous process, take the soft tissue slack of like her traps or skin, and if you've got a big dude, maybe some adipose tissue, and then I'm going to kind of bring it out to get the soft tissue out of the way, just to help stabilize. So I'm here on the lateral articular pillar. <clears throat> so I'm going to be here, a little bit of rotation. I'm going to come out into that um, that pillar, lateral articular pillar, right at that level. And then I'm going to stabilize with my thumb here on her chin still. This one is going to come right here on the uh, back of the occiput. And then as I'm going, you should feel like my applicator down to that level floor. Mm -hmm. You feel that? Mm -hmm. And you'll notice like her head's just chilling on the pillow. And then when I do, right, when I add my vectors, right, I'm getting my butt wiggle. This is like the puppy, so Cooey's like super happy. And you can see like the pillow's moving with it. Um, so same concept, right? I've got my feet pointed towards rec. My hands should be nice and relaxed, shouldn't be too bad. Um, I just gotta be careful with ladies and their earrings, or if a gentleman has earrings that I don't wanna compress here. Um, so I'm stabilized, and I've got her. So I'm gonna add in my side bend, side shift, and same thing, I'm going down to the level with my, um, with my short applicator right here. So side bend, with my butt wiggle, side shift, with my dorsiflexion, and then I'll add the spin, and then you go. So same concept, you can think about getting chin up a little bit right there, as opposed to down here, where I go rotate, I'm up, and then I go, okay. So I'll run through that, it looks pretty similar, like C1, C2, right? Great, so we're gonna go through that again, this one will be live floor, so we're here, um, get her set up where I want her, um, in terms of table positioning, uh, the head of the table slightly up, got a little bit of free rotation. I like to stabilize immediately right here. And then I'm gonna get the soft tissue out of her dinky neck out of the way. Lateral articular pillar. I'm gonna add in my side bend. Let's shift. Yay. 